one word that best describes Rise is community. Empowering. The opportunity. Comfortable. One word that best describes Rise to me is home. Rise is home. Yeah. I would describe Rise as an interdisciplinary program to develop the next generation of leaders for planetary change. The RISE program began in 1995. Jane Rice, who is on faculty in NatSci, was the founding director. When RISE began here at Michigan State University, we were located in the basement of Hubbard Hall. Uh, one of the first things I did when I came on board was to see if we couldn't relocate the program. Page forward about 10 years and I got my wish. Um, we relocated our program here to Liberty Hyde Bailey Hall. It's the perfect place for RISE because Bailey was a well-known plant geneticist, botanist, poet, um, first chair of horticulture here at Michigan State University. So now RISE is located in the hall that's honoring someone that is very near and dear to our heart and cared deeply about the planet. Staying together in Bailey Hall as Rice students, I think is very important because MSC is a very, very big school with a lot of students and a lot of freshmen. Um, we just come in with a lot of confusion from high school, different places, different backgrounds. So I believe staying in one place as freshmen um, helps a lot build the network and the family. And I think that's pretty important in, you know, succeeding in school because you always need to have people that you can go back to and talk to. For RISE, I've been part of two teams so far. When I came in my freshman year, I was part of the RISE blog, and, and my sophomore year, I became a mentor, so I was part of the mentorship program as a mentor. My role as a PM mentor was to work with students to navigate different resources on campus, um, help them understand a few things that could be academic related, but also their social life at MSU, and you know, what they can do to get over some anxieties and distresses that come along with schools. I've been a part of mostly the B team. Um, I've worked in other teams as well, like I've done the greenhouse stuff. Um, I've worked a little bit with mushroom team here and there, um, but I'm mostly a part of the B team. My favorite RISE experience so far was being able to install a pollinator garden on campus. Um, I worked with the B team and a couple other leaders and we were able to attend a conference where we learned more about how to go about installing something like that. And then we worked with infrastructure planning facilities on campus and they helped us to find a location and decide on plants and we were able to plant a garden um, in the center of campus with signage promoting it, pro promoting sustainable planting for honeybee health. Um, and that was a, a big highlight to be able to bring the team together. It was beautiful and to be able to see something like that that I had planned and started was really awesome for someplace so big to be able to find, make your imprint. There are many clubs at the RISE program and I was very interested coming in and trying all of them. But when I came to campus, I was most involved in the mushroom team and the bee team. Um, in the mushroom team, I came in and I'd heard that they were drilling for shiitake logs. And coming from a Polish background, I'd been morel hunting and collecting puffballs for soups. And I thought that was super cool, so I wanted to get my hands dirty and, you know, break some soil, plant a strophirium garden, which was going in that fall when I was on campus. And so I got involved with Dr. Benito at Plant Soil Sciences Building to learn sampling and changing slides and kind of manipulating the hyphae to grow in the types of inoculate that we wanted to. And uh, him, along with Chris, uh, they taught us how to create these millet bags that we could hang in the greenhouse. And so by the end of my first year, we had this cool cycle of having the mycology bags growing in the greenhouse, releasing CO2. So if the plants are getting fresh CO2 directly onto them and then they're releasing fresh oxygen right up into the bags, it was fantastic. Being a manager of the greenhouse team, my responsibilities include talking with chefs about what crops they want us to grow, as well as delivering crops, harvesting, planting, um, overseeing all of the greenhouse team, and leading tours. RISE has provided me with the space to learn. Uh, in the greenhouse specifically, I've been given the opportunity to learn how to run my own farm and to manage a group of students, which in the future will help me as I hope to farm with children and run my own farm. So it's given me a great uh, test run experience that's pretty low risk as I'm allowed to make mistakes and learn from them here before I'm in the real world. 
I've been involved in a lot of things in RISE. One of the biggest ones is tutoring. Uh, I helped a lot with that um, throughout my years here in RISE, as well as I was an undergraduate learning assistant, and I also am a part of the blog team. My favorite RISE memory was when our freshman year during the seminar, uh, we went to Baker Woodlot to just find a time to you know, be reflective and sit down in the forest and write down your thoughts about what was going on in life, what you were thinking about, what was stressing you out, what was making you happy, what you liked about college, all of that. And so as someone who's always doing things, it was really nice to just slow down and just think about you know, life in general. It just made me feel really calm. And so, you know, the RISE seminar is over, but I still go back every semester because it means that much to me. It helps me, uh, you know, collect myself and stay calm. And it's just one of those memories that uh, it's a continuous memory, something that happens, you know, to every, every day. For me personally, RISE has given me the opportunity to grow as a leader. Being able to be a leader at some someplace so big and find something that is for you, that I can be a part of for so long, it's been really valuable to me. Personally, RISE has allowed me to go forth into college and try different things with much more social ease and academic ease and understanding that the professors are there to help you, they're easy to talk to, and they're here for you. You can knock on their door, you can talk to them as much as you like, and college is here for you to take advantage of, and you might as well try it. One word that best describes my experience at MSC is courage. And this is through, I get it from the slogan, Spartans will. It's a way to show that we're courageous and we are willing to do anything and everything. So it comes with courage. No matter the challenge, we're willing to do it and face it and be able to conquer with a lot of energy and courage that we have.